Hey everybody, how's it going? So this is going to be a multi-day thing. I'm doing this part at 11.17 on Wednesday. You're probably going to see everything tomorrow night. So I got to take my trailer back to the storage unit. The whole point of this video <laughs> is... Well, this is a return I need to make. Luckily, it doesn't have my address, so not worried about it. So I picked up 12 of these 2 terabyte um, HSG uh, Hitachi uh, Gold Star uh, um, SATA drives from somebody and I am transferring ownership of them over to uh, Madame Roy. So rather than shipping them to him, I'm going to take a road trip down there. And uh, so I got to get a few things ready with my truck. It's still a little messy from my last uh, road trip, which was only a few days ago. Because <laughs> we came back on Friday. I got a lot of it cleaned out, but it's still a little bit of a mess. But uh, this I have to return to um, the locker at, uh, at uh, Amazon. There's a save a lot up here food store that has a locker there. I'm going to uh, put that in the box and ship that back. It was defective. I actually talked about that yesterday. Well, as of time of filming yesterday's video that we use that thing to uh, control a winch. But, uh, yeah, so I'm not going to ramble on this part. I'll talk to you guys later. I know this isn't about the trip, but I don't really have another place to put this footage. So, and it doesn't work. It doesn't warrant a video of its own. So I had had the S10 parked right here next to this trailer. And then somebody had parked a boat basically right up against the door of my camper. So I would have had to have moved it to get back inside of it. Well, they had, it looks like they took their boat out. So I parked the S10 over there and this trailer here because this is the, even though this is the most annoying trailer to have or for me to use it's my most commonly used one so it made more sense I had it between the two campers over there I got to move some other stuff but that's just a quick little update on that and uh, I'm standing on the trailer now just because I can. In case you're wondering, on the windshield of the S10 is a solar battery charger. Um, that keeps the battery at about 80% so that whenever I need to start it, it's, it'll fire right up. It actually does a really good job. Uh, actually, this guy here has on this trailer, he has a solar panel mounted to the back window of the trailer and then has his cable running up here to his batteries. Yeah, they, it's a pretty popular thing in the RV world. Let me get down here. And so, I'll get back to the stuff that matters in just a second. All right, so Matt asked me, he goes, yo, do you have any vintage computer stuff you'd be willing to bring with you? And in the words of Cletus McFarland, hell yeah, brother. So, I got my IBM 51. 60 with the IBM uh, 5151 monitor. It's a monochrome green screen. I've got, this is not the original keyboard for it. It's one that has a switch. But I have something else that I want to show you guys. Uh, it's at home right now. I got some Pentium 3 systems. That one's a Pentium 3 system. It's all scuzzy. Uh, this is a Pentium 2, but it's in an AT case. I have a 486, I have another 486, and I have a Pentium 4. So, what I'm kind of doing, I don't know what we're going to do yet. I'm kind of representing, oh yeah, and I also have a Pentium. I think this one's a 200. What I'm trying to do is represent a whole line of uh, computer, whole uh, 
a bunch of errors of computing. So, some of these have never been on my channel. Some of these have been on my channel more than just about anything else. But uh, it is 91 degrees outside, and it's not 91 degrees in my truck. So I will probably be see seeing you guys tomorrow. Well, good morning, everybody. It is 9.09 .09 on August 12th. I just had to come back up to the storage unit because I forgot a couple things. So I just came and picked them up. Sorry I'm not using my mic, but I haven't been using my mic so far in this video. I might not even use it because like, I'm not working around stuff right now. But yeah, I'm here at the storage unit. You can probably see the units behind me. I realized I forgot to shoot this part as I was pulling out, so I just ran in between a couple random ones. But yeah, it is 9.09 .09 and give me one second. Sorry, I wanted to put the address in and I didn't want wanted to say the address, but uh, it's saying it's a four hour and 51 minute drive and I arrive at 2.02. I still need to get gas, so I'll send him a picture of the screen from there. I know I'm gonna stop at least once. I thought it was a lot, I thought it was a closer drive than that, but I guess not. Um, but yeah, I'm on my way to go see Madam Roy. I'll talk to y'all later.
Yeah, I'm filming too. I cannot tell you how many times I've curbed my tires on that stupid thing. I don't know why. Like, I'm, I'm good with the width of the truck, but... Oh, well, my lens is probably going to fall good. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Yeah, I'm just yeah. filming with my, uh, with my cell phone. Yeah, mine has been GPS, so... Wow. Oh, that makes sense. Yeah. Yeah, Android Auto, man. <laughs> yeah, I, I yeah. got... I'm old school, so I have, literally have to use my phone still. <laughs> so, uh... Do you want to see what I brought, or? Yeah, yeah, let's right. take a look. Well, well so, we got this going on. So let's my see viewers have already seen this, even though they haven't, because I still do. So this is the IBM 5150X, or 5160XT. Unfortunately, it's an MDA, so I had to bring the monitor. Okay. Because I don't think you have any way to make that work. I don't think I do. Is it, uh, yeah. so it's Hercules. Is it yeah, Hercules? It's, yeah, I believe it's Hercules. Yeah, it's got the Hercules. So it's got a random Pentium 3-ish, another Dell Pentium 3, some Pentium 2 stuff, 486 stuff, because you said bring whatever, so. Oh yeah, yeah, I figured, <laughs> well, I figure we're going to live stream later on tonight, yeah. so literally, uh, and we're going to have plenty of stuff to talk about. And actually, if you come to this side, my truck's a mess right now, because, you yeah, know. Yeah, I can see your, I can well, no, because I also just drove 200 and some miles. <laughs> That's true. But, uh, true. Packard Bell. Oh, my God. Um, that's a I, Pentium 120 with 64 megs of RAM. Is that, that's a, is that a legend? Is that a yeah, that's, Bell no, legend? no, no, actually, it's a Force. It's okay. been on my channel before. It's been a long time. Okay, because I had a legend <laughs> back in the day, but, man, yeah. it's been a long time. And then, that's the other... Side. Oh my gosh! Let me let me. So I kind of brought everything here. from XT to Pentium Four. I can see that. So is that a is that a four eighty six? This one has spent a lot of time on my channel, as did that one down there. Okay. Yep. I've re I recognize yeah. those and the compact. This here is what I wanted to try. I actually ordered this for December, but it never showed up until like almost February. Yes. From Russia. What is it? This will allow you to use an AT or PS2 keyboard on an XT. Oh my gosh, that yeah. is so cool. That's what I figure if we were going to live stream or something, we should try that. Um, in the bed of the truck, I didn't come too, too loaded. Okay. <laughs> well, your back is definitely loaded up. So. Well, you said, because you said, you said something vintage, so... Yes. I'm like, well, let's see how vintage. Because they haven't seen a lot of vintage stuff on my channel. Recently. Yeah. This is that Fox. Of, oh, crap. I brought my S on the S controller. <laughs> uh, I figure. Oh, yeah. Let me. Like, can I dig into some of these goodies here? So like, we, we can. Got? What I wanted to try. Now, that's a controller board, yes, right? That's, that's a floppy or a hard drive? That's yeah, that's floppy. A, that's a floppy hard drive for uh, these to local bus. Wow. Oh but what gosh. I wanted to try is somewhere in here, there's a floppy controller that I wouldn't mind trying in the XT to see if we can run a normal 1.44 meg in that. Man. All right. Well, listen, I'm going to pause this because this yeah. vlog is going to start getting too long. Mine's going to get long because I'm going to have about 20-some minutes of footage from the, from the uh, Chesapeake Bay Tunnel Bridge. Oh man, that's yeah. going to be awesome. And what we're going to do, uh, like I said, I'm going to live stream later on, and I think he's just going to vlog. Is that, the, is that the idea? I figure if you want to both live stream or whatever, you got better internet than I do. Like, two people couldn't live stream at my house. We do. Well, we'll figure it out, <laughs> yeah. and I'll talk to you guys a little bit later. Anything else you want to say right now? Not really. All right. Talk to you guys on the flip All right. side. What he said. Were you okay? Um, I didn't realize it was getting that late. Literally, it's like four, almost 4.30 now, and our thrift stores close really early here, like 4 or 5 o'clock, so we're probably going to have to hit it up probably tomorrow. tomorrow. Um, but I did wind up finding something, so I'm going to turn around and show you what I got. It's actually pretty unique. I don't find many of these at our thrift stores. Especially got, in the shape. It's actually it, very clean. It is. I am absolutely shocked. Let me turn you guys around here. I'm still getting used to this, so bear with me for a minute. Yeah, mine's still rolling, but I don't care. All right, folks. So what I got is this Lenovo ThinkPad. Um, you can see I paid 20 bucks for it. Um, and it's really in good shape from what I can tell. Now, of course, no cord. Yeah. It's some type of Core i3. 
I, I'm thinking it's got to be at least a fourth gen or newer because that's the newer. Actually, um, you know what I didn't notice is they say uh, SS on the uh, on the USB ports. Super speed. So they're it's probably at least a third gen or at least a third gen. It's got it. I'm looking at this and that's the newer symbol. So it's got to be at least a fourth gen. I'm yeah. hoping it may even be newer than that. But what I really like. You can see that it's had minimal usage. These keyboards are very prone to wear, yeah, as Eric knows. And they're not, like, even the space bar is not that shiny. So That's usually is, one of the first things that you, that goes is the space bar will go, like, super shiny. Hell, mine, mine look, mine's shiny as hell. <laughs> that's right. So this has definitely not been used much. You can see it's got the ThinkPad logo. I don't have, I, I don't, it didn't come with the cord, and it uses one of these weird, I don't even know what you would call them. It almost looks like a USB plug. Yeah, it's like a barrel jack uh, cord, which I think I do have upstairs. I'm Does hoping it? that I have one of Does those. Does it say on that what that is? No. So we don't even know, like, what kind of, I, I'm going to assume probably a DVD burner. Uh, that's what I'm thinking too. I doubt that would have a Blu-ray, yeah. not being an i3. But, Probably not. Um, we're going to head inside because Eric is not used to the heat here. And beyond, well, I mean, so I've been working outside at my place, but it's just I was in 66 degree temperatures in the truck yeah. for five hours, <laughs> and then I come out and it's just yeah. When you <laughs> go from heat to or cold to heat like that, that's when you start getting headaches. Yeah. Hey, there's your mail guy. Okay, we're going to head inside, and I'll talk to you on the flip side. All right, I'm probably going to end things here with the vlog today. So we're in the middle of setting up our live stream. I think I have stuff pretty much how I want it. So we're going to go live tonight. I'll probably set this video to go live tomorrow, which will be Friday. Wait, today is Thursday, right? Uh, yes. yes. Today yes. is Thursday. So it'll go Monday, live Friday morning. So anything you want to add? No, nope, I'm just looking forward to this live stream, trying to get this uh, yeah. all squared away. Yeah, yeah. this I think I had on my channel once. Check, check. And uh, I, I've been wanting to get it on the channel ever since, but I've never really had a good... Yo, yo, yo. Good reason to, but today is a good reason to. So, thanks for watching. Have a blessed day. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Sweet.